The F40 is considered by many to be the finest Ferrari ever produced. It was the last Ferrari Enzo worked on before he passed away. The F40 was commissioned to celebrate Ferrari's 40th anniversary. It had to embody the true essence of Ferrari. It had to be lightweight, agile, and powerful. Basically, it had to be a Formula One car for the road. Many cars of this era were using alloys and light fiberglass to keep the weight to a minimum. Ferrari insisted on utilizing lightweight carbon Kevlar because of its lightweight potential and its high strength. Also in an effort to conserve weight, there was no radio, no carpets, there weren't even door handles on the inside. All of this made the car very, very light. It only weighed 2,600 pounds. To move this lightweight frame, it is powered by a small 3-liter engine, but what makes all the difference is the two gigantic LM turbochargers, producing 478 horsepower. The end result is a 0-60 to 60 run in under 4 seconds, and even modern supercars have trouble keeping up. It was the first production car to crack 200 miles an hour, which makes this car the very first of the modern supercars. This particular F40, serial number 74049, makes this car really, really special. This car was a prototype, designed to be a show car, a photo car, and a test mule. It was this car that was on display at the Paris Motor Show in 87, and then was used as Enzo's personal car. It was destined to remain in the Ferrari Museum, but it only stayed there for roughly 10 years. Rumor has it that Luca de Monazello, former head of Ferrari's Formula One racing program, gave it to the brother of John Luigi Brittoni, head of the famed Pasta family. There are many features about this car that make it even more intriguing. For instance, this car is 400 pounds lighter than the production version. Every panel is thinner and lighter. The rear hatch alone saves 35 pounds. The headers are made of magnesium to help reduce weight. The interior also has a higher level of detail with the inside door panels being painted and a lot more features on the inside. In addition, the rear window is completely different than the production version. The rear wing has five slots, where the production version only had four. This car also has a lot more power, thanks to even larger LM turbochargers, producing over 600 horsepower. If the F40 is considered by many to be the ultimate Ferrari, F40 with the serial number 74049 is the ultimate F40.